Oh my fuck! Holy shit! That ain't right! That ain't right! No! 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 No, mate! No! No, mate! No, mate! What the fuck? Oh, you! Fuck! Alright, you fuck, come on. You wanna fuck? Oh, shit! Okay! You, oh, my god. Come on. Ah! Jesus fucking Christ! Yeah, that's right! Execution. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna execute your motherfucking ass. Execute him! Execute him! Come on. Yes! Fuck that! Fuck that! Whatever the fuck it is! Fucking bitch! Yeah! Nice! Oh shit! Fuck! Where are these bitches coming from? Come on! Oh, Jesus! Come on! Oh shit! Fucking hell, there's two of you! Alright, come on! Oh my god, I don't even know where they're coming from. Oh my god. Okay, understood. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Come on. Ah, oh, Jesus. Got you. No! Ah! Nice. Come on, just die. Execute, execute. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, cool. Execute both. Come on, here we go. What? Yeah, nice. Die. Nah. And again, and again, mate! And again, my man! Oh! What? Oh, fuck off. Nah, you're getting executed. Where are you running to, bitch? What happened? I slew most of them. The last one got away. Grain, I need your arm I'll head up to street level and keep after him. You two go that way and head him off. Understood. Well, this took a ridiculous turn. I'll, I'll toot the hole. Oh my god, that is a gun. Wow. Okay. Let me let me pursue this motherfucker before it fucking escapes and fuck shit up. I'm coming. Come on. Da na 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 na. Saving people. Saving people. Da na 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 na. No, I got no, I got him. Don't worry, it's on the control! Don't worry, guys, relax. It's only a fucking half man, half beast, half crazy motherfucking I don't even know, but don't worry, I got it. I've got it. It's chill, relax, it's calm. It's calm. Come on, let me just Come on. Come on. Shoot it. Shit. Oh my fuck. It's only a bruise, don't worry, you'll be fine by the tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, come on. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Boom! Yeah, don't fuck with me! That's what I was about to do the first time. <laughs> Everyone alright? Yes. Percival. We've neutralized the threat on our side. Good. I managed to capture one of the half-breeds. Rendezvous back at Regent. Acknowledge. Let's go. <laughs> Sir! What should we do with him? Westminster to the catacombs. We'll deal with him later. Ah, Sir Percival. I thought the Order of Her Majesty's Royal Knights might be mixed up in this affray. We had reason to suspect a rebel incursion, Commissioner. An elementary conjecture. In that event, perhaps this might be of interest. What, Chuck? Uh, purely circumstantial, of course. I call it evidence. Well, circumstantial evidence can be a tricky animal, my dear Sir Percival. You may think it is pointing at one thing, but shift your point of view slightly and 
You may find it pointing in an equally uncompromising manner at something entirely different. Please, indulge me with your musings, Commissioner. Well, first the Rebellion, and then this Jack, and the Ripper murders. Mm -hmm. And then this. Strange, don't you think, that Whitechapel has become the epicenter of our recent conundrums? We must examine every clue now, you see? We meet in council two days hence. If you would do us the honor of presenting your findings. You can expect me at Westminster. Over here, sir. Do excuse me. Where have you been? Bloody London traffic. Mon général. What of the other half-breeds that escaped through Hyde Park? We must pursue them. No. Mais notre devoir est de les poursuivre, monsieur. Marquis, nous ne chassons pas des Anglais sur les nouveaux continents. Votre temérité sera requis à un moment opportun. Oui, mon général. I will be governed by your advice. I'm sure you will appreciate that for the time being, this must remain a police matter. Of course. Something's amiss. The underworld in Whitechapel is known to give safe harbor to the rebellion. That's precisely what troubles me. Why would so many half-breeds be found in Bedlam? Some things we need to find out for ourselves. You heard, Commissioner Doyle. It's a police investigation now. Knights do not relinquish their authority to bureaucrats. Percival is right. This matter should be brought before the Council. Off to the Council we go. Centuries have passed. But our order has remained steadfast in its sacred mission. To preserve the balance between man and half-breed. Such was the quest of our founder, King Arthur. May his name be forever resplendent. Is it true? Did the Lord Chancellor fight by Arthur's side? That is the legend. Today, that balance is threatened with grave upset by a new contagion, the rebellion. As long as its campaign of anarchy and terror is allowed to continue, the plague of lichen infestation that has infected our city will only grow more intolerable. Well, the Lord Chancellor will thus agree to the urgency of a mission into Whitechapel. Whitechapel is a matter for the civil authorities. When the noble Arthur sought to contest for truage with the Roman Emperor Lucius, he did not trouble himself with issues of jurisdiction. Do not presume to quote history to me, Sir Percival. <laughs> I've seen more of history than you shall ever know. I remind the knights here assembled that the threat to this order comes not only from without, but within. We must stand vigilant together lest our ranks be poisoned by those who seek the destruction of all we hold sacred. No one is immune from the rebels' influence. Surely the Lord Chancellor does not mean to question Sir Percival's loyalty. This order has long appreciated Sir Percival's counsel, but the current disruption calls for caution and concerted effort, not rash action. Sir Percival has cause, Lord Chancellor. The situation in Whitechapel may need to be addressed. Does Lord Darwin speak with the blessing of the peers? Lord Hastings, Lord Dunglass. He does, Lord Chancellor. Perhaps the question should be put to the Council. Very well. What says the order of Her Majesty's royal knights in the matter of Whitechapel? Aye or nay? Nay! <laughs> the nays have it. This council okay. is dismissed. Uh, I'm, pre I'm pretty sure more people oh, said yet. Yeah. Okay. Too prudent, Grayson. We wither away from this inaction. Leave it, Sebastian. Caution be damned. Sir Percival is most agitated. You should learn it is best not to cross him when his mind is set on something. Okay. And I'm in the council. Can I run around? Can I run around in the council? 
Should I talk to Igraine or to what Percival has said? Igraine? Need I remind no. you of your place, Lady Igraine? Who are you to question the council's wisdom? Okay. Yes. I'm just gonna leave that. I'm just gonna be here. Uh, alright. Well, I guess I better look around. Uh, just walk around, do my tang. Oh. Can I go up here? Oh, can I jump it? Oh, so I can't jump that, but I can jump. <laughs> jump a fucking huge ditch. Okay, cool. Understood. Galahad will deal with this in due time. I have a more pressing matter to attend. As you wish. How many of us will make the journey to America? Oh, Lord Barrett, Lord Darwin, and myself. I've heard many great things about the Agamemnon, Lord Hastings. Oh, she is the finest the United India Company has ever built. I can promise you a pleasant and speedy journey across the Atlantic. Can we expect your presence at the launch? Sir Lucan. Would be my honor to see you off on your maiden voyage, my lords. Sir Lucan, if I may. Um, if you would permit me, my lords. Of course, Sir Percival. Alistair. You know, as well as I do, that Whitechapel is the key to these disturbances, to everything. My opinion is immaterial. The Council has spoken. Few dared countermand your father's express wishes. Need I remind you that we all serve at the Lord Chancellor's pleasure? You are the Knight Commander! Make him see reason. You think an incursion into a rebel stronghold is reasonable? I consider it an acceptable risk. One for which you'd be willing to accept full responsibility should unforeseen circumstances arise. Let what befalls be upon my head, no one else's. Whitechapel remains off limits. That is officially. You have my thanks, Sir Lucan. Of your thanks, I have no need. Bring me results. As the Knight Commander wishes. Well, we're going in. Most excellent. When do we move? You're not talking about Whitechapel. But my Your brother sought fit to permit us a reconnaissance. Secure the necessary materials. Isabeau, a word. Tell me, monsieur, about the Lord Chancellor. What is a Marquis? Sir Lucan and Lady Egraine were adopted by him, yes? Yes, they were. Why would he bring them into such struggle? Perhaps he wanted to regain a semblance of the humanity he lost. When time came to join the Order, the choice was theirs to make. Regardless, I would not wish this life on my children. Marquis, we need to hurry. Oui, mon général, avec plaisir. Monsieur. Friend Mallory has always been something of a rogue operative. I've never known a better man. Still, I shall rely on you to be a, call it a sobering influence. Sebastian and I have long been partners. I trust him with my life. A little restraint would not be ill-advised. Huh. Do look after my sister, won't you? No man in the realm can keep Isabeau from danger when she's of a mind. Oh, you say true. What's a brother to do, eh? Good luck and Godspeed. Hmm. Always at your service, Sir Gallagher. Interesting. Who's Sweet. Tesla? Ah, Tesla. Is that, the man. That's a car, isn't it? Is, that, is there a car? Do I have to follow a car? Okay, well, I guess I'm not going through that door. <laughs> right, can I go through this elevator? You're going to close it before? Okay. Show me. Quite a few intriguing things, if I may say so. Further news of the uh, trouble in Grosvenor Square? Police are investigating. And investigating. Lycans, on the United India Company's front doorstep, what do you make of it? Mayfair isn't what it used to be. Awkward! <laughs> really awkward. Permit me to oversee a few of my new experiments. Uh, in the meanwhile, take a look around, uh, play with whatever strikes your fancy, but do be careful. 
Okay. Ooh. 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 Wait, so do I get to play with some shit? Wait, let's check that out. Nicola, how fares your friend Edison these days? Thomas and I are not on speaking terms. <laughs> Lol. The man is an idiot. All right. Um, do I get to play with like new guns? This is like. This is like uh, what do you call that? James Bond. Is that scorny looking guy, Professor? Professor? Agent? Is it Agent? Special A Special Agent M? Or just M? So is it just M? I don't know. I'm confused. Why is there jizz stains everywhere? And reverse. Nicola. Oh, okay. Huh. Okay, um There we go. Oh, okay, shooting range. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. So no, okay, I can't play with that. Can I Sir Galahad? Play with it any What do I do? What's going on? I wanna play with some guns. Let me shoot shit! <laughs> Hey! Please, this way. Okay, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, cool. Here is something you may find interesting. This device allows you to convert between Edison's inefficient direct current and my superior alternate current. Quite handy for overloading and incapacitating certain electrical systems. Look at the flick of the wrist. Woo! Look at the flick of the wrist. Woo! Look at the flick of the wrist. Look at the flick of the wrist. Look at that blink of the wrist. Look at that blink of the wrist. Look at that blink of the wrist. It's comprised of an inverter, transformer, and rectifier outfitted with some brass clips to enhance the design. Oh, and a fine leather carrying case. Inside each tube is a small quantity of mercury. When I don't know what you're talking about. Just talk to me in layman's terms. Is it a bomb? It's a bomb, isn't it? It's pretty much a bomb. Um. Look. Oh, shit. Okay. Ow. Ow. Ow, oh, for fuck's sake. Ow. Okay. Nice. Nice. Wait. Oh, okay, I've locked it. All right, come on. Nice. There we go. You never cease to amaze, Nicola. What the fuck? What did that just do? I don't understand what just happened there. Can someone explain this to me? <laughs> yeah. There we go. Something I can understand. Impressive. You've always had a good eye for craftsmanship. I've outfitted this one with a telescopic sight. It's ideal for long-range shooting. I would be honored if uh, you would test its efficacy. It's a sniper. We it's get it. Pleasure. Come on. Oh, look at the look at the wrist. Okay, we're gonna let's shoot this shit. Come on. There we go. Nice bullets. Man, these graphics are insane. Fuck. All right. Uh. Bullseye. Oh, okay. Bullseye. Okay. Um, right. Oh, that makes life even easier. Oh. Nicely balanced. Oh. All right. Click and hold L3 to steady your aim. Yep. Just like Call of Duty, baby. Recoil is sharp. Oh. But manageable. Some muffling might be in order as well. I'll attend to it immediately. So, are there any other of my children that you would like to meet? The offer's tempting, but I must return to the others. Of course. Oh, the monocular that General Lafayette requested is over there on the table. I'll see that he gets it. 
I know Jimmy Savile would have had different answers to that. <laughs> Want to see my children? Yeah! Yeah, you got more children? Show me! <laughs> we scour the district in pairs. Isabeau, you and Lafayette take the high street from the south end. Galahad and I will move in from the north. Why not give the Frenchman to Galahad? Mademoiselle doubts my intentions. I promise to remain at all times the picture of chivalry. I'd prefer to have someone more experienced looking out for me. I thought you needed no looking after. Very well. You team with Galahad. Mademoiselle will perhaps one day allow me to demonstrate my skill. One day? Remember, we are entering rebel territory. The insurgents will take umbrage at our incursion into Whitechapel. You've an little discovery in Mayfair. The London Hospital should be our target. Strange to think Lycans would find sanctuary here, is it not, monsieur? You really believe the rebels are collaborating with the half-breeds? The Lord Chancellor is convinced of it. I have my doubts. Do you trust anyone, Mon General? Never accept. Always question. It's a motto that's seen me through the centuries. Stay vigilant, all of you. We can expect hot work here. Ah, quelle joie! A nest of cut purses, collaborators, and whoremongers. I knew it very differently once. Ooh. All right, well, we're going to pause it there, and we'll play this, or continue playing this, in the next episode of... Or the 1818 18th. I've just fucked that up. Hey, I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace.